So I said to the waiter, I'm dead famous, you know, because I'm famous and I'm dead. <laughs> oh, don't hold corpse at once. <laughs> don't hold corpse. Oh, whatever. Welcome to... Too late now. Shut your lids. Welcome back to Chatty Death. Please put your hands together for our next guest, the former Lord Protector of England, Oliver Cromwell! <laughs> so, Ollie, 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 Ollie! Can I call you Ollie? Cool, cool, Ollie it is. Thanks for coming on the show. Didn't really have any choice, so... Anyway, after you died, your body wasn't looked after properly, so had to be buried in secret because you smelt so bad. <laughs> What's that? Oliver what? Oliver Strong smell? Very good. He's good, this kid. <laughs> so tell me, Ollie, how would you like to be remembered? Well, I suppose as someone who did what needed to be done, I'll admit I did some pretty horrible things along the way, but it was a small price to pay to make sure that the monarchy would never again rule this country. Hmm. Do you want to tell him or shall I? Oh, you tell him. It's a bit embarrassing. No, all right, I'll tell him. Tell me what? Oh, it's just a little thing about Charles the First son coming back, being crowned King Charles the Second, murdering virtually everyone who signed his dad's death warrant, and having your corpse dug up and beheaded. What else is it? Oh yeah, and the monarchy still ruling in Britain today. Hardly worth mentioning, really. Yeah. <laughs> Any famous last words? <laughs> anyway, that was Oliver Cromwell, everyone. Sorry, what's that? Oliver Pongwell! Not as good, mate. Oliver Pongwell is not as good. Chatty death, chatty death. Hope next time it's not you. Woohoo! Ghastly, mean and cruel. Stuff 